Hi, welcome to this introductory video on SAP Warehouse Management Training. In this video, I'm going to give you a small introduction on what is this training about, what are we going to cover uh, in the training and how does it benefit you. So before anything, uh, let me give you a brief introduction about me. So who am I? So my name is Samir Surevanshi. I am a SAP LEWM that is Logistics Execution and WM Consultant with around 10 years of experience in SAP. I have worked largely on uh, SAP WM implementation projects and the contents of this course uh, come from my experience as a SAP LEWM Consultant. So what this course on SAP WM training is about? So this course on SAP Warehouse Management is an online video training course and is a mix of relevant theory and ample hands-on system demonstration and ideas for each and every WM concept with a detailed explanation. I have included all the concepts, all the functionalities that SAP offers in SAP WM and I have given the relevant theory and I have shown in the training how you configure each of those scenarios. So this training is geared towards training you to become a SAP WM functional consultant. So by end of the course, I am sure that you will be able to work as an SAP WM functional consultant, provided you are able to uh, practice whatever I have taught in the course. And who this course is for? So anyone who wants to learn SAP WM can take this course. Uh, the project team members, business analysts can also take this course. But there is a small requirement uh, or, or a prerequisite that the participant should have an understanding of basic processes in logistics execution, that is goods receipt and goods issue. So if you are aware of these concepts, you have some basic knowledge of SAP, then you can uh, look forward to take this course. Okay, now uh, let us understand what we will learn uh, in this course. So, when you start with the course, I have started with the very basics of the conceptual knowledge of, uh, knowledge of warehouse and then I have built on these concepts and covered all the scenarios in the warehouse. So, you will get a clear understanding of the organizational structures in warehouse management. You will learn how to configure the control of put away, stock removal and stock transfer activities at a master data and customizing level. So we actually go into SPRO and uh, check what is the customizing to achieve different uh, functionalities uh, uh, given by SAP in put away or stock removal or in stock transfer. You will learn how to integrate warehouse management into logistics. You will learn how to configure the interface between inventory management and warehouse management. So we will understand how the movement types in inventory management uh, correspond to the movement types in warehouse management and how to achieve the different uh, functionalities or different effects in put away or picking uh, by doing the relevant configuration. You will learn how to implement put away and a stock removal strategy. So I have uh, described uh, multiple put away strategies and multiple stock removal strategies and how they are configured. Next you will also learn how to set up batch management and also I have included a session on WMQM interface that is quality management in warehouse. You will learn how to include warehouse management in delivery process. You will learn how to stage components for production from warehouse. That is, you will learn how to set up the WMPP interface. You will learn how to set up the warehouse activity monitor as a control instrument. You will learn how to set up and execute physical inventory at a storage bin level. So apart from the configuration for physical inventory, I have also included a session on how actually a physical inventory is carried out. And uh, finally, I have included a chapter on how to do blueprinting for your warehouse. So this uh, chapter alone is worth all the experience that I have got for, uh, as, a, as a SAP WM consultant. So I have included uh, the relevant scenarios and uh, questions that you should be asking your clients and how you should go about uh, taking the requirements from the client and configuring your own warehouse in SAP. So if you really want to learn SAP WM uh, from concepts to configuration, I'm sure this course will really help you. 
You can check uh, details on my website SAP Dublin online. Thanks for watching.